Hi, Peter here for the Basic Pilot. On today's test flight, we're going to check out the Crane 2 gimbal from Shayung. There are a lot of videos out there already about this gimbal, and most of them are great. I wanted to see if I can implement the face tracking feature with a Canon 80D and a little something extra. Let's see if we can do it. In order to make this work, I'm using a Crane 2. I have a uh, Swiss Arca plate on top, or Arca Swiss, however you say it. It's one of those quick release plates. I prefer those. I've got one on my ADD here. Now this should work with a 5D. I don't think it'll work with a 1DX. I don't have either of those cameras, so it may or may not work, I don't know. So what I've got is the Canon ADD. In this case, I have a 17 to 40 lens, but it'll work fine with the kit lenses that you have. I borrowed my daughter's iPod because it's super light. I've got a little tiny phone holder, which is a, you know, fold up thing here. And I've got a hot shoe mount. So in order to make this work, I'm going to mount the camera. I am going to bring the viewfinder around so that I can see what I'm doing when I'm shooting just to make sure that it's actually working. Now to make this work, all I do is I connect the little hot shoe mount. I mean, some of you may even have these phone holders that have hot shoe mounts on them already. You can use that. Okay. The app that you're gonna use is not the ZY Play, it's called the Zayung Assistant. You get that from the App Store. Okay, let's turn on the crane. And let's make sure we're in the lock mode so that the joystick has full control. Uh, it will not work properly if you have it in uh, follow. So all I have to do is on the Assistant is hit the connect tab and it'll show the crane there gives me a little heart, tells me it loves it. And then you gotta go down to camera and we're gonna put it in video mode. And there is a settings button and you need to make sure face tracking is turned on. You don't need that other stuff like video stabilization, GPS tag, forget that. You just need to have face tracking turned on. And now I'm gonna mount this That's all you have to do. It's it turned on, it sees me. Now I can move over here. I can move all the way over here. Okay, so it, you know, if you don't have a, a, an extra cameraman to do your presentations with, this is a really easy way of doing it. That's all there's to it, pretty simple. So you gotta admit, that was pretty easy. So grab your kid's iPod, Grab a little phone holder for it and a cold shoe mount adapter and you're on your way. Hey, as always, thanks for watching. Oh, and you know what? The stuff that I used in here, you'll find the links in the description. Hit that subscribe button if you like what you saw. And if you didn't like it, hit it anyway. Give that bell a ring so you know when I upload my next one. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.